Okay, today we've got the um, 20 litre Azito wet and dry vac that we're going to try out. We've just done a, a demolition here where we've pulled the old Safeed out. You can see behind us there's a lot of rubbish and rubble that we haven't been able to pick up with the brooms. So we're going to try this uh, little bad boy out and see how it goes. Um, it's wet and dry so you can use it for soaking up a bit of water as well. This is brand new out of the box. And it comes with a uh, 1.5 metre hose. And we've also got these attachments which make up the, uh, the handle. So you push these, push these three extension pieces in. That makes up the broom handle. And in here we've got all the other um, components like uh, the uh, broom, the uh, fine uh, nozzle, handles, and a few other bits and pieces. So we'll read through the instructions, we'll assemble this, and we'll see how it goes. This one's 1250 uh, watts, so it should have a fair bit of power for what we need. And it's nice and compact, which is going to be good for getting it up on the roof and uh, into some tight spaces. All right, let's check it out. All right, so we've got a few different attachments. This is the filter cover that goes on the bottom of the motor. Um, it goes on here when you're doing dry clean, so we'll put this one on, the dry vacuum. goes on like so. Uh, we've also got this um, dust bag for fine dust. So this can actually go inside here and it attaches on the back of the inlet valve here. So we put that bag in and we can click that on if we want to use it for fine uh, dust. So the dust I've got today is a little bit wet, a little bit damp, so I won't need the fine bag, otherwise this will get wet. And um, it also comes with this uh, little foam um, pocket. If you're doing wet vacuuming, you need to take off this blue filter and then this slides over the top of it here. I won't do it for now because I'm going to use this for dry filter, uh, for, for dry vacuuming, but if you need it for wet, this is what you use. connection for vacuuming. Vacuuming goes in the bottom, blowing out goes in the top. What we'll do, we'll vacuum the back. Put it into position. Alright, we've also got the other attachment. We'll plug it in, see how it works. See here after you take the bag off the, the fine dust that, that picks up. It's just a matter of giving this steel container a bit of a clean out. So there you go, a little Azito. Works pretty well. It's only about 39 bucks, so it's a cheap DIY model, but it's powerful enough to work on this uh, demolition site and get rid of all the uh, dust and rubble. So that's a good little tool. Check it out.